A new product could help people with Parkinson's disease, and it started as a high school project. WCPO 9 News reporter Keith Baragolic visited a Florence nursing home to see this possible solution in action. Patty Schneider is writing birthday cards for her nieces and nephews. That might not sound like a big deal, but... I have Parkinson's. A disease that can cause tremors. I do have tremors occasionally. And the reason I'm on the walker now is my balance is getting a little iffy at times. It means something as simple as brushing your teeth is not that simple. I've had little tremors my adult life. Schneider doesn't shake much, but she knows that her condition could always get worse. It can be hard for people my age to understand what it means to get old. But for four high school students in northern Kentucky, they took that as a challenge. It's personal for student Reagan Farkas. Because I have a lot of unsteadiness with my hands, so sometimes like just simple things like missing my mouth when I'm eating or something like with a fork or hitting my gums when I'm brushing my teeth. Farkas imagined a toothbrush holder with a handle strap. And the idea is to make it so that you can't lose it, you can't drop it. Uh, and easy to grasp, easy to, to control. With a little help from 101-year-old Dwight Harris, Farkas and other students developed a prototype the residents here are testing. It was an amazing experience. I was very impressed with the girls. The students aren't sure what's next for their project, but the people here at Magnolia Springs hope it can help people outside their community too. And I appreciate you so very much. In Florence, Keith Birigolik, WCPO 9 News.